So one of, one of those recurring cast members is um, who we know as, you know, singer, songwriter, and actress, Brandy. What was um, the initial interaction like with you, Brandy? And I know, I think Brandy, mom was her manager at the time. What was that, inter that first interaction like? We seem to be, uh, we get along, you know, at first, yeah. And then as, as time progressed, how, what the, um, what started to unfold? Because I know you've, you've mentioned that, you know, there was some disrespect during that time. So just painting, painting the picture for us, what, what was that process like that led up to the point where you felt like there was a lot of disrespect? I'm going to say this, and Symphony, uh, I want you to hear me, and I want everybody that's watching to hear me. Let me say this, you know, uh, Brandy is, uh, I know, know that I knew this was coming, so don't, don't think I didn't know. I knew it was coming, Sim. you know, because people, I've been quiet for 20 years. Why is that? Because I don't give a f I didn't get on verses. I didn't get on, well, I just told you, I have no social media skills. I don't care. I do not care. I, you know what, it's so silly because, you know, it's 20 years later and you know what, uh, there is more pressing things going on in the world than versus Monica and Brandy singing. That's, that's what, that's what sparked it, right? The, uh, the versus. And I want to, I want to read a few tweets um, based on that versus just to kind of get an understanding from you yourself. Um, so from your Twitter account, it says, I'm tired of people coming at me sideways about Brandy. I never said she wasn't talented. I do and will always fundamentally disagree with her and her mama's disrespect while we work together on my sitcom. And I stand by that. Your favorites can be wrong sometimes. Stop being selective about that. Just because you like a celebrity's work, we are all humans who do sh that need to be checked for sometimes. What, what was going through your mind you know, as you were um, essentially releasing, releasing that. Uh, uh, that's on the Twitter, right? Yes. Okay. First of all, I don't have a Twitter account, but it, since you brought it up, once again, I go back to, I don't do social media like that. But I did say years ago, years ago, I said that. Someone probably made a fake account and just tweeted what you said years prior to this versus. Years ago. And that's what I thought, you know, and that's so silly because I, when I, well, okay, when you got my cut, you got my cousins calling me, you got my girlfriends calling me, I go, what are you talking about? Girl, you own TNZ. I go, oh, for what? What I do now? What did I do now? What did I do now? Let me tell you something. You know, and I've heard her retort. I heard her retort. And um, I haven't said nothing about her. When times when I, I could have kicked her, but I didn't. Right. Because that's not who I am. I don't kick people when they down or when they're having troubles. And I don't deserve to be kicked either. But, it, you know, but I can take it because I'm that bitch. I am. I am that bitch. I do want to ask, um, because, you know, now that we've established that those tweets were obviously something you said years ago that someone has brought back. If Brandy was watching right now, what is it that you were want to communicate to her, if anything? You know, you've done well for yourself. You have a child that graduated college. Your success. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. God has blessed you abundantly. He gave you favor. I'm not your enemy. I am not your enemy. It was such a long time ago. Everybody makes mistakes. You made them. I've made them. Let go. Let it go. Because I have. Because, child, I got nine grandchildren. I ain't got time for all this. Book. I ain't got time for it. Are we safe to say that there is no beef between you and Brandy? Are we safe to say that right now on the Comedy Hype News Show, it is squashed? There's no beef between Miss Thea Vidal and Brandy. I don't have any beef. I haven't. What would it. What? 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 
What do you want me to do? I mean, what, 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 I have to give birth to baby Jesus again? What, what? I don't, I, you know what? I, I didn't, I didn't think there was, I didn't know we was beefing. I didn't, I really didn't. Thank you, Thea Vidal. It was definitely a pleasure learning more about you and we'll definitely check out your show in Houston this upcoming Sunday, right? And what, what was the name of the venue? Two shows Friday, two shows Saturday. And what's the, what's the name of the cafe? Bill and Derek's Restaurant called the Speak Easy.